What is good, YouTube? It's your boy Skin. As you can tell, today's been what build I'm walking around this park with. I'm back here today with another banger build. As y'all see, it's called a two way password guard, but this lockdown build can dribble, shoot, finish, and then of course it can defend because that's what it do. I'm gonna let y'all know this build. This build's gonna go crazy. It's not as short as the build from yesterday, the two-way three-point player. If y'all wanna check out that build, make sure you go check it out. This build is about, I don't even tell you, six four already. So you get all drum moves, but you're still tall. So let me just not waste your time anymore. Let's get into this build. All right, y'all here in the builder. First, I'm gonna show you how to make the build, and then I'm gonna go back into the park and show you how you um what what would you give you make it as a rebirth build. So you gotta go shooting guard. Everything else is up to you. You're gonna come down to the red and green pie chart, the half red, half green. I passed it, didn't I? Yeah, it's right there. The half rare half green, so you get Hall of Fame shooting and Hall of Fame defending on this build. You gotta pick the pie chart with the most speed, because that's what you gotta do. Aiden, max out your close shot, max out your driving layup, max out your driving dunk, and put your staying dunk to 35. You do only get two finishing badges on this build, but trust me, you get limitless takeoff on silver, you're still gonna be dunking on everyone. Max out your mid-range, three-pointer, free throw, and put one on post fade where you get 17 shooting badges. And I'll show you what badges I would use personally, but we'll get into that later. Max out your pass accuracy, ball handle, and put your post control to a 50. You get 13 playmaking on this build, which is good enough to run the one if you need to. I wouldn't say you can run the one every single game, but if you need to, it'll work. Max out perimeter, lateral, steal, defensive rebound, and put the last nine on block to where you get 19 defending badges on the build. So you get two finishing, 17 shooting, 13 playmaking, 19 defending. Don't worry, after we're done making the build, I'll show you what badges personally I would use. And then say we'll get into that rebirth. You can choose whatever body type you want. You can go, I'll probably go define honestly. You're gonna go six foot four down, so you get the plus one speed, plus one ball handle, and um, you get all the drill moves because that was six four and below. So you get the drill moves, it helps you. You do get an 80 ball handle as well, 99, so you'll be you should be you're gonna go down to 178 pounds. That's what you get the most speed, you get plus one strength for minimum. So we have 178, you get 90 speed, 89 XL for wingspan. You gotta go up three from default to 83 points. You also see you do lose two three pointer, but you keep the same ball handle. Your defense goes up, and your chase downs and just your steals in general will be a lot better. You don't want to go anymore because you'll get 75 to 75 ball handle, so you won't get 80 and 99. So at 83 points, let's go over your stats at 99. You get 78 driving dunk, very solid. 82 three pointer, 85 mid range, very good. 80 ball handle, so you get the good dribble moves, not the greatest ones, but you get good ones. 90 perimeter defense, 90 lateral quickness, 98 steal, 78 defense rebound. And at 99 with gym rat, you get 98 speed, 97 excel, 79 vertical. All very good stats. As y'all see, once you come over, you get a choice between lockdown, shot creating, slashing, and play take. Y'all know me, this is a lockdown build. I gotta go lock take. Come on, bro. I know it's not the greatest this year, but it's still be putting in work. You have built the two way pass first guard. Shades of Donovan Mitchell, Clay Thompson, and Richard Hamilton. I'd say Clay Thompson, Richard Hamilton, Richard Hamilton are more closer comparisons than Donovan Mitchell. But who knows? Donovan Mitchell do be going crazy out here. So now I'm gonna get into showing you what badges I use. We're not even gonna put that up because I'm not even testing the build in the builder. For the two finishing, limitless take off on silver. This is the most OP finishing badge in the game. If you don't use it, I don't know what you're doing. Uh, for your 17 shooting, Hall of Fame sniper, Hall of Fame stop and pop, Hall of Fame hot zone hunter. Silver corner, silver catch and shoot, and then probably like bronze dead eye or maybe bronze green machine if you want. Bronze lucky number seven. It's your, that bronze badge is your choice. Personally, I don't think you need blinders because you're not going to be shooting many blinder shots. So mostly you're going to be spotting up. I mean, I guess if you're running point guard, I'm using this lock. Well, if I make this build, I'd be using more as like a catch and shoot lock. So that's the badges I use. You can do whatever you want. So for 13 playmaking, I go gold quick first step, silver handles for a day, silver unpluckable, bronze bella, silver bullet passer. Bronze hyperdrive and silver quick chance. So you can still combo up some moves while not getting ripped as much. Being able to bail out. Bronze bail out at least is what almost all players need on this game. And then all your builds want to have bullet pass for two. If you have a build one play making, I'm sorry. That's kind of rough. 19 defending. I go bronze clamps, gold interceptor, hall of fame intimidator, gold pickpocket, silver rim protector, bronze chase down, bronze ball stripper. And then you got four left that you can honestly do whatever you want. You can put on menace. You can put on pickpocket hall of fame, interceptor on hall of fame. I probably got Rim Protector on Hall of Fame, put Chase down up to Silver, and then put Interceptor up to Hall of Fame. All these other badges are your choice. I'm not sure if Menace really works. A lot of people said Menace did work, but no one's ever actually like tested it yet. Because I'm not sure. So if Menace works, you can let me know in the comments section. I can throw that on this build. But those are the badges I go with this build. So now let's walk over back to the park and show you what you'd get if you make this as a rebirth build. 
Alright, I'll hit up here in the park. Y'all see back on the two-way pass for Scar, 60 overall. If you make this build a rebirth build, which if y'all didn't know, they did fix the rebirth in this past update. They dropped a 30 gigabyte update today, or yesterday when this video is coming out. So they dropped it and someone they said that the rebirth should be fixed. So if your rebirth was glitched, which I know a lot of y'all commented on my rebirth video saying it was glitched. It should be fixed now. So you should be able to easily make a rebirth. So I'm just gonna come over here. I didn't really quite see how many exact attribute points you get. I'll show you later. We probably already saw it. I just didn't see it. I'm gonna just show you that it gets you up to it should get you up to 90 overall on the dot. But who knows? Sometimes it, it'll be glitched. No, y'all see 90 overall. You start with 87 speed, 86 excel, 68 vertical. Not horrible. Come over to the badges. You get one year two finishing. Put bronze almost take off lines. You're gonna put up the silver anyway. Hall of Fame sniper. And then probably gold hot zone hunter. Maybe. Since you don't really have any hot zones yet. Gold stop and pop, maybe. Whichever one you want to do. It depends on how fast you can get your hot zones. Uh for the five playmaking, since I'm mostly a spot up block, I'd probably go like silver bullet passer. Bronze unpluckable, bronze bailout, and then a gold bronze quick first step to start out. Just to start out, you know, because I'm not going to run point guard on that build just yet. I'd get all my badges before I even try to run point guard. For the 7 defending, Hall of Fame Intimidator, Bronze Chase Down, Bronze Rim Protector, and then you can either go like Bronze Clans or maybe Bronze Interceptor if you want to try to get them passing the lane steals. But, uh, yeah. Y'all see, we're kind of coming in at the end of the video, so if you made it this far, make sure you follow my Twitter. It's going to pop up on screen right here. You can get in contact with me there, find what videos are dropping, when they're dropping, get the MA at any time of the day. There's a good chance I'll see it, but uh, yeah, I know I know it's two build videos in a row. I'm not gonna lie, I had no teammates on today, and y'all know I do not like playing with randoms. Respectfully, I cannot do it unless it's for a video. I just I just can't. So uh, yeah, whenever you, I'll get a teammate here tomorrow most likely. Cause I don't work tomorrow. I had like class and work today, so well, it was busy today. It's all good. We still getting a video. I'll video every single day this year. I haven't missed a day yet. You can go look. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Guess what? I haven't missed an upload this year. Or since 2K22 came out, I have not missed one day of uploading. I was just running around the park. But, um... Yeah, nah, we going crazy with the uploads. I should do... I got a new guard build that I want to show y'all. I'll make a build video on it. Even though I put it in my top five guards video. But honestly, y'all ain't see that. None of y'all saw that. So I'm going to make a separate build video. I'm going to put a game plan in there. That build's fire. I got a couple more NBA player videos coming up. If y'all want to know what my next one is, I actually said it in my video yesterday. In that build video. I gave a hint. I'll, I'll, I'll give y'all a hint, too. You can go back to the video yesterday and see which one it is, but it is on my 99 slash and playmaker, so if y'all want to take some guesses in the comment section if you didn't watch yesterday's video, go ahead and take you a nice guess on who you think I'm making a video on. Actually, I actually got a couple of them, but one specifically I'm doing first. Um, if you made it this far in the video and you stick through my long conversation right there, comment lockdown skit in the comment section so i know you made it this far in the video we probably what about eight minutes into this right now but uh yeah like i said let me know any of the video ideas you guys got in the comment section below current gen next gen gameplay tips challenges builds i want to get into more next gen but i don't know i don't got no vc right now i'm struggling to even buy boosts but uh yeah like i said let me know the video ideas you guys got twitter and twitch are also in the description make sure you drop a like subscribe and i'll see y'all in the next one